Good morning, everyone. We're just so excited to have with us today Christian. He just graduated with his BS in Neuroscience, and we're very excited to have him here with us. And so congratulations, Christian. Oh, thank you. I knew he was in town because I saw the pictures on Facebook, and so I thought, I got to give him a call because I know you guys wanted to see him. You've been asking about him. And so we're going to be doing an acne treatment on him today. And... So what I'm doing right now is go ahead and opening up those areas so we can start doing extractions. So Christian, are you uh, going to take a little bit of a break? Yes, I'm going to have May off for Yay. myself. That sounds wonderful. Well, you deserve it. Thank you. So I went ahead and um, prepped the skin with our glycolic wash. And I'm um, just going to go ahead and put some pressure right on the base of the blemish just to go ahead and get that all cleaned up. And I'm going to go back and stretch, bevel up, and just go ahead and open up that pore. And right at that base. And Extract. Double check this. So I asked Christian how long he was going to be here. I think I asked all the good questions. Mm -hmm. And he said he was going to be here till um, I think July. He's mm -hmm. got to take a test. But I'm going to call him to see if we could do more videos on him. I hope all the mothers out there enjoyed your Mother's Day weekend. And I know I had a really good Mother's Day weekend. It was wonderful. I got to spend it with my family. Again, stretch. And right at that base, okay? And I'm going to go ahead and use 27 half gauge needle and bevel up right there. About a 35 degree angle. We're also seeing Daryl. So it's gonna be a good month for me. I get excited to see all my friends. I get to come in. Christian is really resuming really nicely, which is good. He, he is clogged, but Christian, I don't think you're as clogged as you used to be. What do you think? It's getting better. Right? Mm. Yeah. It's wonderful. Stretch that skin. going to go back in here too and double check those areas through here. I don't know if that camera will catch it, but it's it's also a little bit clogged. I'm going to go in there and stretch that area. How are you holding up, Christian? Okay? I'm doing good. Super. I've known Christian for such a long time and I feel like he's just growing up on mm -hmm. me here.
So when are you taking your test, Christian? Uh, at the end of July. So are you ready? Oh, not yet. <laughs> not yet, okay. I promise I won't call you every day to come in here, but <laughs> I'll give you some time to study. I am going to go ahead and wash that area um, for, um, for Christian. And the reason why I'm going to do that is because the glycolic wash continuously decaps the follicle. So it allows, um, allows me as the practitioner to really uh, go in there and exfoliate that area so that um, we can get to those uh, pores that are clogged. So I'm going to go ahead and just do that so that you guys can see that. A lot of times I do this off camera. But I wanted you guys to see it. Okay. So I'm going to go ahead and stretch that skin. I'm just going in for those little tiny ones. I'm going to make sure that we get all this cleaned up for him. And there's some right here. Plus by washing, I'm also keeping that area clean so there's no chance of just, you know, running um, of any bacteria getting back into those pores. I'm going to check one more area right there that I see. Yeah, there it is. What I love about um, this wash is that if there's anything underneath it, it'll bring it up to the surface. I'm going to just kind of move them to the side here. There's little ones there that we're going to go ahead and take care of for him. I'm going to work on this other side and I am going to you could see where it's all filled with little, little, more little cysts tiny little ones through here so I'm going to go ahead and uh, just make like a little just a tiny incision right in here to open that up a little bit more for him so that way It comes up a little bit more and we can clean that out a little better. As you probably know about me, I don't like to, my philosophy is less trauma on the skin is better. So I try to make a small, as small incision as possible or a little opening. I don't make incisions, but. Okay, so that's part of it right there. Go back and right on the base of that pore. How are you doing, my friend? Doing good. Okay. I'm making sure.
back and just make sure everything is clean. And I'm going on every angle just to double check and then let's go back to this one. One of the things that I always say whenever extracting, make sure that the area is nice and dry. Um, I do use an oil in, in occasions, and we'll talk about that on a later video when I do extracting videos, but um, on this occasion, I, I, I don't. But um, make sure that it's nice and dry and that your, your, your Q-tips are not soiled. We're going to go up here and get that one. And I'm going right at the base at the bottom there. Okay, I'm going to check this one. Again, I'm going to go back and open that up right there a little more. Stretch that skin. Get to that pore. And Christian, how are you holding up? Doing good. Okay. There's still more stuff in there, so I gotta get, and you can see it, I gotta get that out, so. So what I'm gonna do is, I am going to clean this up, but I am gonna go ahead and go back and wash that area. I want to thank everyone for joining Christian and I today. Yay! <laughs> Definitely we're going to be seeing more Christian this summer, so it's really nice. And you'll get to see um, some um, other treatments that we're going to be doing on, on his skin. Like always, I just appreciate your support, your love, your kind words. Hope you have an amazing, blessed day. And look us up on Facebook share our videos, tell others about us. Um, I'm almost at 250,000 uh, subscribers. That's just hard to believe, my goodness. So um, again, thank you. Love you guys. See you soon.